today. Boy, we were just kind of like right there under the wire. I got on a little cleany spree. Izzy's table's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Did you notice P's area? Look at that. Look at that. Some might, might not feel that, you know, that's different, but it is. Trust me. Very. Good stuff. over here. Em over there. Patricia. Mariah. And together we, we are PM Artist Studio. So happy to have all y'all here. Do say hello in the chat so we can say hello back because we love to but if you want to hang out in the background that's totally fine but we do ask if you are enjoying the stream to give those thumbs the upsies. One of the other things that is super duper helpful is if you guys come back after the stream and leave comments. YouTube likes that, and so do we. I think we appreciate it maybe more than YouTube, but YouTube rewards us. <laughs> do they? Yeah, by showing our stream to other people. Oh. That's, that's the, the, the reward. I was mm -hmm. thinking more tangible results. <laughs> it, well, you know, I guess eventually it, it leads to maybe, you know, some monetary thing of, you know, them giving us ad money and stuff. Maybe. Make sure that this is. Just you look cute. I love that outfit with your glasses. It's, it's spot on. Me thinks. Uh, oh, no, we are not bored. Uh, there's plenty to do here. Oh. But, yeah. So much to do here. I'm a little stressed out, but that's okay. It's part well, of the deal. We'll be very, very happy when the website's done. <laughs> yes, because it's, it's all consuming. And it's, 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 everyone's a little bit on edge around here. A little bit, a little bit. Because we're like, oh, we're getting so close. And then it's just like, oh, then you just find, you know, oh, yeah, but I need to do this. Or, oh, shoot, we should probably do that. Oh, by the way, we should revamp, you know, some old products. That's what we spent yesterday doing. But very exciting things. So when the website launches, you guys are going to be like, ah, that's so cool. Yes. Hopefully. <laughs> that's the plan. That is the plan. Let's say hello to everybody. Do say hello, hello in the chat. Do say hello in the chat. All right, we, we've got Anne, Miriam, Heather's here. Yay, Heather, I hope that you've been getting some sleep and your sleep pattern's better. Belinda, Betsy, Brad's here. Carrie, Charmaine, Colleen, uh, oh, Colleen's Dreams, hello. Uh, Kim, Diane's here. Darcy, Eddie, Ellen, Estella, Evie, Jacqueline, Effie, let's see, Jacqueline, Joni popped in there, I think, or Judy P, Carrie, Linda, let's see, that keeps popping in and out, Kathleen's here, Carrie, Linda, <laughs> Lisa Mingus, Lollipop's here, Lori, Marta, Michelle, Nightbot's the one you want to watch out for, she drops in all the links, prompted by our mods typically, but she does things on her own as well, Patty Fulton's here, Panka, Renny, hello, Renny, Respect Design, that's a Kiko, so glad you're back, Ricky Nordmeyer, I am so happy you are here. I was I'm I was meaning to send a message to you just to check on you. I, I'm so happy you're here. Are you home yet? I wanted to know about that. Silver Granny, that's Lynn. Sirius Hecka, that's Lisa. Star Traveler, that's Linda. Stitching Art, that's Paula. Susan, Texture Junkies, that's Sharon. Tina, Trish, Violet. If Violet's here, is our friend Fran here? Violet, have you been talking, Fran? Where's she at? What's going on? Uh, if I missed you, it was not on purpose. It's just that little participant thing. I wish you would kind of lock them in for a minute. Just, and then, then, then I wouldn't, you know, have to, like, work that out. But there we go. Good morning to all of y'all. So happy that you are here. Now, we have much to discuss. Much to discuss. You have, do you know, you have a, 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 a close pen? Yeah, it's because I'm try trying to get it to, to lay down and I'm hoping it'll develop a memory. Because I. You want I a silver one? I mean, it, might, it would go with your jewelry a little better. Here. That's true. But see if I unbutton that button, then my really cool necklace that Margie got me gets lost in the mm -hmm. shuffle. Yeah. It goes back under there and then you can't <laughs> see it. There's, there's really is some method to my madness here. Mm hmm. Um, I don't know if you guys noticed, also I was able to adjust the camera position. I really just needed about an inch. And so I put a little extender 
if you guys could see the, the hot mess of Griswoldy situation that we got going on over here. It, it, it is. It's a bit scary. It is. I, I hope that we don't have a... Okay, so do you want to do this box thing? Or do you want to wait till the end to do the box thing? Well, I hope we should just do it and get it out of the way. Okay. Because a lot of times what happens is we, we run... forget. Yeah. I forgot to put my other bracelet on. Oh. So, one of these companies, you know, well, and of course, it's going to be backwards in my thing because I flipped my deal. But, um, here, I'll hand it over to P. And I'll get us going. Um top side here so they reached out to us and said hey would you like to try one of our little arty box things and I said well yes we would and I was very much hoping that it was going to be this one or the polymer clay ones so these are muse kits they used to be a different name I forgot what it was that's my bad um it really helps if you can figure out how to open well, it just to get a punctured yeah you slide the front out there very swell elegant mm -hmm. you know little nice swirly box. swirly design there you can fix Kudos that puncture. to whoever mm -hmm. okay so here's your inspiration inside laurel points muse kit is a community of artists and hobby hobbyists looking to remain creative and empowered during their busy lives laurel points are our way of saying thank you for being a member of our amazing community. See, everybody got their erotic perks. Everybody has. <laughs> Earn rewards. Share your work. Each Muse kit includes four monthly prompts to spark creativity. Y'all can check that out. Let's get in the box. <laughs> I even sent a little lolly. We had to hide this because I was like, I did pre-open it because I wanted to know which box we got because I wasn't sure because they didn't tell me. They just said it was going to be one of the past ones. Cool thing is, is you can go over there to the website and you can purchase the past ones. And I think they're on a little bit of a sale. So you can just purchase one. Oh, I don't think you have to subscribe little, or anything. This little cool little green thing. I might have to have this. Well, of course you would. Look, it's got on a slant. I know, so I think you put your markers or your pencils in it, and then... Well, I'm not crazy about the color, but we know how to fix that. <laughs> Spray paint. Spray paint! I'm oh, just... P has been, like, with all of her organizing and everything, she has been, um... She has been covering her little boxes with gel prints. Ooh, what's that? I don't know. It's some kind of a pen. We'll have to test it out. Is it good to put? It looks like a nice pen. Oh, it's what? Oh, I don't. I really. Those make me. Oh, is it like angry. a mechanical? Yes. I, I don't want those. And here's a teeny tiny. Oh, it little. has a little click on the side. That's kind of cool. Here's a permanent liner. Ooh. Water based, water resistant. Well, that doesn't. Yeah. Resistant, resistant. is not the same <laughs> as. Yeah, that's a little... I don't know. Well, we'll have to try those dudes out. Nice little eraser there. Don't use those very often, but... Look at this cute little packet of Bristol. And we already know we love that. Bristol board. That is just so... That's great see, stuff. See, it's artist trading card size. These people have kind of tuned oh, into all that. I didn't even notice that. That's fantastic. Isn't... They say it there. <laughs> right there um, on the package. Right there on the package. I don't know what this is, but there's a, a rose there that... Hello to worry about somebody in. eating it or something. Hi, Nadine. Hey, Kathy. Hey, Sherry. Okay. Well, whatever. Then there's this little thing in hey, here. Anthony. Illustration, your tools. Tells you about all the tools. We thought Izzy would really enjoy this. The, the pencil, the Royal and Lang Nickel, Lang Nickel colored pencils. I've never used those. Well, I was it, pretty pumped about that because, yeah, I figured it was a brand that we'd Yeah, not. that's the Twisty Race Mechanical. And it's Pentel. Desktop pen and pencil organizer. It retails for $12. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Would I spend $12 on that? But I don't hey, think let's, so. But this is the cool stuff you get in the box. So, you know. Strathmore Artist Trading Card Pack. Well, yeah, that's Strathmore. That, the Bristol board is the thing. Use his How to Draw book. Oh, here we go. Look at that. Step by step. Daisy likes those little things. Yeah, she does. Oh, look at this. She'll love this. The blob, think that's the really, Joker. Yeah, really cool. <laughs> flower, flower the screaming at you. Yeah, P, P will always give her honest. Uh, uh, okay. 
Muse Kids Guide to Cartoons. That's now, the thing is, that they were talking about in the little magazine. I think that Izzy will really enjoy this. And this is really good for her because it's it's making her start seeing sh the, how the shapes work. Yeah, I, 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 I... So I think that, yeah, this would be a cool gift to send. Especially, I think, probably a little bit older kids for sure, but... Well, I know I would be excited. That's to do. But Yeah, I like how it shows you how you start out with your basic shapes and turn the basic shapes into, you know, whatever. That's why she likes that one channel. Yes. Because now, it, we'll have to check these pencils out. Yes. Because um, I've never used Lang Nickel, but I, I don't think they're probably going to be all that whoop de doo because they're only five ninety nine retail. Uh, so I might you know, have, no have, judgments. Have my doubts on that one. <laughs> okay, now let's see here. Markers. I know. I'm pretty Spectrum pumped about those. Spectrum Noir. Oh, and here's a cute little sticker. sticker. Well, is he all love that? Don't give it to her. You should put it on your um, put it on your laptop. Your oh, stickers. I should. It's cute. I'm always excited about it. <laughs> you know, I didn't used to get excited. I'm going to move this box for a second. Heather likes step-by-step -step drawing. Oh, bless your heart. Um, oh, hello, whole 180. Do tell us who you are so we can say hello. Okay, to the these are, so how many of them do you get? It says. Oh, and you've got some coloring stuff here. Isn't that cute? Let's throw that away. I should use the back side though. Oh, um, and just on, on the note of announcements, um, I'm not going to go through everything, but we have, you know, here we are coming up on the, you know, what, two days left in February, because that's how February works. Um, so keep your eye out on the first, starting on the first, new announcements for like the, I think we're going to do ATCs. Joni, let me know. I'm pretty sure it's time for ATCs this time. Um, and, uh, let's see. Okay, you get two. Oh, it's a double ender. I love those. I'm not too crazy about it. Oh, that's nice and raw. Is you like that? Those are mine. Oh, these are yours? Yeah. Boy. Oh, look. I, I like these little. I'll give her the old junky ones. Because she doesn't respect the markers. She doesn't. Well, I'm going to keep this one. I will say, knew. though, her little kit, her brush kit that P got her, she has kept it together. I, that has been life-changing. I'm pretty pumped about those. I don't really... All right, here. I'm going to hand those back to you. Fantastic. I shall assimilate I'm gonna, those. I'm going to see if see about these colored pencils. I'm very, <laughs> very skeptical about the colored pencils. And the first thing we'll do is throw away this really awkward, nasty plastic thing. Oh, I know. I, I feel like I'm always going to get cut on them. I have, like, you if, know, If they do cut. develop little, little, little things that are... She just chucked it over to the... Hey, mm -hmm. I almost made it. Did you? Yeah. Alright, well, let's see here. Let's swatch these dudes out. What are you doing? I was going to say, that's coated paper. That that's, you're not going to get very far No, with that. No worky. Hey, that's not too bad. I mean, well, if you want a real review, he's hey, your girl. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm impressed with the price. I'm like, well, you don't have to love it, but you, you know, don't have to be mean about it. Oh. <laughs> That's always my. Feeling. Hey, Izzy knows how to use white. Hey, those have some nice hey, color. They're not bad. She's at not all. pushing Good hard. Cover. I'm, no, I'm just doing my regular. She, she's not doing like I do. <laughs> yeah, the, the death stomp. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Oh, that's kind of weak. But you know, that seems to be what happens with the, the neutrals. Yeah. Oh, the yellow's pretty good. I mean, you know, it isn't great. Oh, um, Carrie says he's familiar with Spectrum Noir as a brand, so it might be a, a British product. Yeah. I'll tell you what, I, 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 I don't, I'm not hating these. 
pretty darn good coverage. Oh, hey, and this, did you, I don't know if you said this or not, I might have been yammer yammering. Um, it, like, has a little mixing guide thing in it. And a little pamphlet that with the markers. Oh, wow, shucky darns. Look at those marbles. Yeah, that's has some, a little, that's, like, know that's your some tools. pencil work there. So the art liners are fast drying pigment ink. It's perfect for drawing clean, consistent lines. You can instantly over color without smearing. Over color without smearing. Mm-hmm. Tip. When choosing paper, keep in mind alcohol markers will tend to bleed on thinner papers. Smooth, heavyweight paper is best. Like that Bristol board stuff that they, it really does work lovely. Oh, Aaliyah. I never throw away a um, tomato paste can. I have glitter every, look at this. What's that from? <laughs> <laughs> the um, embossing powders. <laughs> oh. I, I, and I like this. I don't know. I need to redo my list. It doesn't say that it's permanent, so I would imagine that it's not. So, you know, I'll put that in there with Izzy stuff. All right, this is for her. This is for her. I guess we're going to give her the Bristol. The little, we're not giving no, her these. No, we need to keep those. Heck, those are already pre-cut and everything. We'll give her this eraser. She, she'll she'll love the eraser. She loves the erase. So, overall, very impressed with the kit. I mean, yeah. Some cool stuff. Thank cool you stuff. to Muse. Thanks, okay, guys. Okay, here we go. Oh, yes, on the can. There you go. Remember where you got those. <laughs> Well, they have it written on there. Well, I'm not going to do that right now because that's really just getting on my very last nerve. I'm pretty excited about these, but let's test these babies out. Because I'm always... Hey, I like this pencil, and I'll tell you, I was, you know, because I, I, I push hard. That's why I don't like them. I know, I always break. break, but I... You gave it a good workout? I gave it a good workout here. Didn't pop it once. <laughs> that That's why I don't, because I, I get a little heavy-handed. With the pencil writing. Alright, what did I do with my little... I'm going to keep the little pamphlet thing. I think that's cool. That has some cool oh, information look. in it. Oh, gosh. That's... That's that's definitely mine. Yeah, you love... That's on the borderline. Mariah likes... She, she writes thick. I do. I, I think these are probably going to be mine. Yeah, those look like yours. Now, here we Ooh, go. Ooh, that's mine. That's me. Look at that. All right. Pigment liner. And, and we don't know how waterproof they are. We'll just give them a little. Well, it's sometimes it's best to let them, if you leave them for a little bit longer, they tend well, I don't to know. be more water resistant. <laughs> I guess if you were going to mush them about and whatnot. But usually when I do my, I, I, I don't. I'm not into mushing it about, so I, I don't know. I, I think that's acceptable. Yes, exactly. Anne says it looks like a great kit for someone starting out, preteen child wanting to, to make art, not only supplies, but some instructions. Exactly. Yeah. And, and you get good little, little, um, you know, it's a good mix of stuff. I'm pretty jazzed about this. <laughs> she gets happy. She told me my energy before the stream was a little intense and I needed to alter it because I said I'm not going, I don't yeah. want to go into it with this uneasy feeling that you're going to start hollering at me. Mm -hmm. Oh! Yeah, you set it up like that. Don't, it, I don't know if it's on the cart kind of situation. The cart, the <laughs> worry. <laughs> now the problem is, is the bottom one's not too terribly slanted. They did give it a bit of a lip there though. Well, that one you could put things that aren't going to peek yeah, out. I just, I, I don't know who was in charge of the color selection on this, but. It seems a little uh, 1950s kind of. Like, uh, you know, mint green, yeah. Some, yeah, some pink. The color they painted hospital walls. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, our school was that color. I, I don't know if it's supposed to, you know, relax you or. I, I like that color. I don't, you know. I don't really hate it. It's just it's kind of in there with Pepto. It's 
the, on the opposite end of this. It's, it's right across <laughs> from Pepto. If you were going to neutralize this, you would use Pepto pink. Okay. Oh, Patricia. That's Patricia over there. And I'm Mariah. Who is this? Somebody wants to know. Mm -hmm. oh. Aaliyah. Aaliyah. Hello, Aaliyah. Okay, well, I guess I'll mess with this later. I don't know. It might become part of my little... Yes, mint chocolate chip ice cream. Definitely. Okay. You could drop some little chocolate chips like on it. I like mint chocolate chip ice cream. Her and the baby do. I, I do. I, I'm quite one. fond, especially the one that has the large, cho <laughs> Carlos, large this... chocolate chunks. <laughs> Emodium green. Yes. <laughs> Got the Pepto pink and Emodium green. You can really tell this crowd. <laughs> we know things like that. <laughs> yeah, that's scary. Okay, so that's done. <laughs> I'm going to show you my cute little box. I'm not going to show you the contents. Isn't that look? look I, you know, it's better over here. Oh, you don't want to let them see what's in the book. That's all you get. That's all you get. You don't get a topside view. And here's my, my vitamins, which I like to have them out here because this is where I usually remember to take them. If I put them in the bedroom hey, or put them in my sink, then... It's really cool. It, it actually has little pockety hand things. It went with my shirt, so that's what I wanted to wear. Yes, that, that's my Alaska scarf. Mm -hmm, I like it. And, and to commemorate the year, I put the rabbit. And our stars. And the stars and the moon. I tell you, the stars, the rabbit, and the moon thing are an awesome trio. Yes. Anyway. Oh, the name of the box. It's the Muse. What? What's on? Show the box, top of the box one more time. Muse kits. They were formerly known as something else. I just can't remember. It's curated in California. Yeah. Did you say that? I don't think so. Okay. Now, I don't know where to pass that through, so I'm just going to throw this yep. down on the floor here. Yep. All right. Now what? Let's get the weaving out of the way. Weave away, my friend. Because we've got some new stencils that I've done some very magical things with. So we want to do that. <laughs> Is Darcy here? Where you at, Darcy? Hi, Nancy. All right. I think it's always a good idea when you're demoing something to at least try it once to see. Scrawler box. Thank you, Estella. What is it? They were formerly the scrawler box. Yeah, that's a better name. That, that was a good... Um, corporate decision. <laughs> Scrawler's a little hard to say. and Muse is easier to remember. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Alright, you remember last week Mariah glued this down. This is the back door. The you big want, door. Turn it around. And this is there we go. The, the baby door. <laughs> and this is the medium door. Now I do have duplicates of the of medium of the medium and uh, I'll tell you what, this cheap gesso, you know, sometimes you just get what you pay for. Mm -hmm. um, I, I don't know that I'd order this again. Show them the big bottle that you're just so happy that you got the big bottle. It's super cheap. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's, I, I don't know. I think I put it back on the cart. Oh, okay. <clears throat> it went back to the cart. <laughs> it went back to the cart. <laughs> but let me tell you something about this whole business of yesterday on this little box... I used Mod Podge. Yes. And I just fought it. It took me it took me two hours to do this box. I did the other one, this one. Fifteen minutes. <laughs> and yeah, fifteen minutes. Bang bang. Done. What did you use that? Reinforce the bottom. <clears throat> what did you use with that one? The the cheap uh, you know, the other stuff uh, Oh the matte medium. Matte medium. Well, and it us works three things. times better. So if you want it to still have a shiny surface when you get done, you know, wait and put the Mod Podge on after you get... Or get gloss medium. Or get gloss medium. <laughs> There's always One that. and done. <laughs> there you go. All right, so I learned some very important things on my first little, little venture here. And I've already... Mm threaded my needle because that's really a painful thing to watch. <laughs> but here are my little strips that I have. And look at this. 
these are ones that I, I might have to sew on to the end of, of these others. <laughs> It, just in case because I have a little bit longer span here than here uh -huh. but I did have to cut some off I'm saving these for tag you know things oh so. yes cigar boxes are perfect for oh uh, scared me <laughs> snuck upon me <laughs> alrighty so I found this clip when I was cleaning off my desk. I haven't seen that for some time. It's one of those ones that the balloons come on. Oh, yeah. With the little we always save them. Little yeah. hoopty do. Don't ever throw a good clip away. Never. I mean, we've even saved one. Remember that? I think we've shown in a stream or whatever, the one that you, that Mazzy chewed up one. And Oh, and I fixed it with a... <laughs> with the hot glue. <laughs> it's a sad looking thing, but it works. Hey, it does. And it works mighty fine. It does. I think Mariah appropriated it and took it away I don't away know somewhere. where the chewed up one is. It has uh, wandered off somewhere. It, it's clipping something. It's clipping something, and obviously it's important <laughs> if we're looking around. <laughs> Hold okay. up something. <laughs> All right. So, we're going to use the same basic. I'm, I'm not going to worry about, you know, hey, repeating Jamie. this. But here's what I learned. When I was doing this one, I, the one that I did before kept coming, and when I'd pull the other one through, the other one... Uh, U.S. Art Supply, Evie. Right? That, that's the matte medium that you used. Yes. Yeah. So here's the dealio. When you get ready to do this, sew them down at the top. All of them. Now you are going to have oh. to... So that when you, you you're getting them through there, you don't keep pull, They you, don't keep inching yes, through. Yes, they don't keep moving about the cabin. All right, I'm I'm very fond of this one. So we'll just go ahead, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to since I figured this out, I'm going to, and I I can save some down here to possibly use for a tag because I think that would be cool. Yeah. I'm not going to get real carried away with the sewing business here. I'm just going to give it a little bit of a attack on and I don't want my really big old knot to show so I'm trying to oh hello Kirsten glad you're here and the thing is is you don't have to undo you know tie it off each time because we're just gonna we're gonna do every one of them before we start any of them okay is it so Kristen or Kirsten let me know. Sorry. No, no worries. I meant to ask that earlier. All right, now this this jobber is really kind of, you know, like right on the money. Hey, these all came from that rug, didn't it? No. Some of them did. I don't know what happened to the rest of them. You got all weirded out and you put them somewhere. Oh, yeah. That's... They're stuffed in the closet in there. I know exactly where they're at. Oh, see, she knows. I didn't know where they were. Yeah. So I didn't have that as an option. If you have things that she wasn't going to ask me. Oh, I wasn't because I was mad at her. <laughs> She's always moving stuff around on me. All right, I, I'm sorry. This has to okay <laughs> go up a little bit. This is not working quite as nicely as I thought it was going to. But well, it's hard to do on camera because she's trying. You know, you're normally you hold this in your lap. Camera, and I would be holding it over here. So. Yeah, you're still visible there. You're I'm good. still visible yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, good deal. Now, I'm not worried about the other side, you know, being ucky or whatever, because mm -hmm. I've already got a plan B for that. No worries. But see, on this one, up here, you can see it's 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 kind of mushy too, but I, I got I got. Well, I don't think that that looked bad at all. Well, I didn't like it. Okay. Okay, so what do we got here? Put some beads on it or something. Yeah. And this little booger keeps... Oh, some of them just shed, shed, shed. And I like that. <coughs> and I saved the little <laughs> wadded up piece of thread for you, Mariah. I've been known to use them. I spit on it. Oh, lovely. That. So it's got my DNA. Most things around here do. <laughs> licking on things. Sounded and... kind of judgy. <laughs> okay, now where are we? Are we in the back or the front here? It's important uh, to know the these back. things. I just need to get to the front. 
separate, so, you know, hopefully. Uh, this is, um, I apologize for this. I should have really had this all done except for one. But you can see you kind of have to fight it. I guess that's good. Yeah. Just enough to hold it in place. Yeah. We're not talking about major yeah. sewing here. And it doesn't have to look fancy or, 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 you know, it doesn't have to be all wonderful or anything. Because you can always cover it up with something if it's ugly. Hey, and this, actually, um, this would be a little bit earlier, but next month's Maker's Creative collab is Dreamweaver. She might have it. Be, she might have this done by the end of next month. <laughs> so it'll be perfect. That is just so ugly. <laughs> that is so ugly. I have to okay, I don't want to use this one right next to this one <clears> because... <throat> I just, I love this little bit of black and white stuff on the end here. And over, I think, no, I didn't. Yeah, I did. I had to. This one kind of frazzled out on me. Oh, All right, thanks, we Nadine. don't yeah. want orange because we've already got orange. Oh, boy, this is going to be. Ew. What? You don't like that? Well, I mean, once well, you leave it just, in, I don't think it's going to. It's short. Oh, you're not going to have enough. Because remember, once you go through it, mm -hmm. yeah. I can make it. I can make it happen. I can always sew something <laughs> on the end. I can go on. through the thing over there and find something to sew it on. <laughs> so I'll just. Hey, I've all, I, I I I like to problem solve as I go along. I just loved it, Carrie. You you are the sweetest person. Mariah uh -huh. read me your your um, message and poor Carrie. He he's worried about my. That, that if it was going to meet your vision. I'm like, she sort of has a vision, but she's always willing to alter course. Oh, heavens yes. I, I look forward to course altering. Yeah. Okay. If, if she got stuck in, in, in what her idea, that's more my area. of. Like, oh, yeah. I love this one. This was, I think this is just absolutely. And I really thought about getting the iron out and you know how long <laughs> Here, that, Lynn, Lynn has that a, thought lasted. I, I love it. Lynn, Lynn's being very diplomatic. What did she say? Question. Shouldn't you tack one strip on top and then the one under under the tape to establish the weaving pattern? Did you do that with the other one? Um, yeah, I did. But. It didn't really matter. Um, okay, well look at it. Can you tell? No. No. But yeah, if you were doing a proper proper weaving, yes, you should. But the whole thing is, is this is what I'm doing right here right now is a whole lot more important than you know having something on yeah. the right. Yeah, I, I think with this particular situation, yeah, it's not a big deal. It certainly isn't for me. Now, if it is for you, yeah, you you can you can you can be as anal about this as you want. I, I'm, I don't have to, I'm not watching you, I'm not looking at it, so I don't really care. I don't, I don't. Yes. But you did do it on the other one. What? You did do it on the other side, that way. You did it under, one under one. Oh. Yeah. But, it's but a, it was a pain in the ass. Oh. <laughs> so she's going the easier route. Like I said, I mean... Anne says freeform weaving. That's <clears throat> right. Yes. We, we believe in that for crochet, so of course we believe in that. And this is also for... more about binding than the, the full-on weaving. Okay, that <clears throat> looks good together. Let's make sure we've got this kind of... Hello, Jim. Welcome, welcome. Yeah. Got a lot of our, our newbies and makers coming over here and vice versa. Love that. The crossover is wonderful. Oh, great. <laughs> Did you sew in another one? Yes, and it was way back there. Oh. No, it's just tangled. All right. I was getting ready to have a total flipping meltdown here. As you can see, this is really not my, sewing is not my. She's a little on edge. I'm trying to keep her talk her down. <laughs> Good job, Mariah. She started off with her 
you know, Napoleonic cleaning bench here. Well, I, I mean, I think that Izzy's table has been a hot mess for three weeks. I, I keep asking her, you know, is today the day you're going to clean it? Well, I, here's I just, the I thing. I want her to want to clean it up. And here's the other thing. So what she's been doing, like the other day, as she just popped Mariah out the chair. As soon as finishes this little diatribe, I'll tell you a little story about her. All right, now let's flip this baby over. See what we got all this? It looks pretty messy. So rather than cleaning the table, what she did is she set up the chair as a table. And I'm like, no, that is, I mean, I love that you're problem solving, but that ain't the way to do it. Why don't you just clean your table? Anyway, you can now tell a story about me or something. <laughs> I used to, I, you know, I, I would I would wait and I was I would say and this was like when she was in elementary school. I was messy. Oh my god. She Extremely. Was terrible. Mm -hmm. Horrible. Probably until about teenager years. And even and then it she was, a was we called her a muralist. She drew on the walls. <laughs> All right, I drew I'm, on I'm, the fan. I I'm gonna go ahead and do my knot because I can't tell you how many times because I am going to sew in place the um, bottom part of this also. I, I may not do that on camera because I think you all can figure out. Oh, Anne says a safety pin would also work. By golly, you're absolutely Tell right. You what, we really need to discuss these things with Anne beforehand. Yes, we do. <laughs> I, I should have just called you. Anne. <laughs> I've got, your, is, pho I got your phone number. I phone the arty friend. <laughs> I'm about to start a project. Let's talk through it, because I'm sure you have way better knowledge about what it is that I'm doing. And I'm afraid if I pull any more threads out of this <laughs> brain not... booger, it's just going to be one big old thing of threads. So I have to be kind of careful. <laughs> all right. Basically, you know, all, all you have to do from then on is just grab one and go in and out. In and out. Up and down. <laughs> in and out. It's, it's just really... I mean, honestly, it's not it's not mm. bad at all. Hey, Tracy. But now you can see why it's important to sew it down up there. Yeah. All right, I'm just going to try to grab the one that I think is next. I, I don't know that, yeah, it's not probably a huge deal with this. Yeah, seriously. And if you went over, you go under. And vice versa. No, oh, Nadine, she's so sweet. She says, I would look at it this way. Izzy is like P in the cleaning area, which drives you nuts. But look at how wonderful P turned out. The future is looking good for Izzy since she has both of you. Aw, thank you. I, I think she'll be all right. I, I just... A little maintenance. <laughs> she'll get there. She will. You gonna do them all? Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, when I was doing my student teaching, I it was at a a magnet school, and I love I loved it. It was wonderful. And in fact, um, there had been an open position there. They would have hired me. They loved me too, um, because I really fit there. But they already had a really cool art teacher. Yeah. And uh, that's one of the reasons that my experience was so wonderful. But had this child we did one of the things that we did while I was there was weaving and he just could not get it so Dr. Platt that was my instructor said uh, here's what we're going to do we're going to take him to the gym and we're going to get a rope and they had parallel bar or you know the things that the gymnasts mm -hmm. use <clears throat> just you know about chest high perfect Boy, that's going to be a titan. Um, so we took him in there, and he actually <laughs> made him take the rope and go over and under and come back and go over and under. Oh, my gosh. And he got it. We got back to the classroom. He was a weaver. He just needed a, a little, you know, real world, uh, you know, larger, uh, what am I trying to say? Like a... Uh, well, it was a whole body thing. Yes. That was the whole thing. Uh oh <clears throat> That's really making me 
crazy and this is really a short one but I, I had to use this one because I really like it she does well with the timer thing that's a great idea Lisa at least this is she's been watching a youtuber called the fly lady she recommends setting a timer for 15 minutes to get cleaning and decluttering done so like kind of like just see what you get done in 15 minutes but the focus is going to be on cleaning the table well, that would involve me having to stop what I'm doing and... There's another <laughs> factor in here. Maybe this is just, you know, her and I. You can go down and get a snack. That's probably best, because then I can actually, you know... Alright, and I, I'm going to do a safety pin on this one, because it's going to come unravel. Oh yeah, Sharon, how is your studio rearranging? Oh, you're welcome, Trish. Thank you. She was so... Oh, she loved that kitty. She loved that kitty so much. <laughs> Trish sent her some beautiful little tags. Oh, and the kitty one, of course. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. If you want... If you want to ooh and all that, baby. Toss a kitty to her way. And then, and then it was cute because she set him out there. And she said, Gigi, what, what kitty is your favorite kitty? <laughs> she always wants to know. Have not that interesting here lately? Which one do you like? <laughs> All right, now let's see. That's already slipped out, <clears throat> so that one goes over. Um, yeah, can, 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 kinetic? Can, can, is that how you say it? Kinesthetic. Am I saying that right, Jacqueline? About the student. And doing something, you know, like oh, with your... Oh, yes, yes. Kinetic, yes. Kinetic. Using your whole body, too. Oh, here we go. With the strings on this. Oh, thing. Carrie says, yeah. And dog clips. Bulldog clips would work well, too. Just you kind could. Of hold. Yeah. You could do that. See, that's why we hang out with you guys. <laughs> there isn't just one way. <laughs> and you can see, as it starts getting, you know fatter mm -hmm. you're you have less of the the rib the original you're not just seeing the one piece of fabric yeah is that what you're trying to say yes something like that thank or you or you're not seeing the um the binding the binding thank you that was <coughs> that, that's the word i was trying to come up with here <laughs> that's right <laughs> what <laughs> Brad says or they all hang out with you to help guide you because they feel so basically that they feel sorry for us <laughs> hey we are a project just yeah, as much works, as it, you it know works what, we're okay <laughs> whatever it takes to get people yeah. to help me I, i'm willing to do Oh, yeah, Carrie, I'm kind of the same way. Like, I, I can read something and read it and read it. And I'm like, this makes no sense to me. You show it to me, and I, I got it. Yes. I, I am very much that. Now, sometimes I like a little of both. Because I'm one I of those kind I of read refer... the instructions at the very... Yeah, after you've done it. You're like, yeah, those were great instructions. <laughs> really helped me out. Reminder. <laughs> All right. So there we go. Look at that. <laughs> he says this is why we are artists, not lawyers. <laughs> okay. True that. So I've got, I've got, you know, the right <clears throat> amount on each end. I'm going to be able to cut some stuff off here. I'll still have some stuff for, but I'm, I will sew that. I am not going to sew that. We already now. saw that. <laughs> done. Done. Okay. There's my needle. Got that all ready to go. Did you just clip that. Are you gonna clip that on there? I, I am. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. And look at this. <laughs> okay, I'm not, I wasn't gonna show this till Tuesday, but I am gonna show it because you might want to experiment with it, and I'm gonna do another one. This is. Do you guys recognize this thing? You've seen it before. Not in this state. <laughs> And I'm going to, 
I'm going to see if I can do something with this stuff. The same, same oh, thing. Oh, yeah. What I did with this is I glued it down. Remember, I used this. It made a really quite uh, impressive gel print. Gel print. And I, I can't remember what I did with it, but it's here somewhere. Um, mm. But I glued tissue paper onto the back of this with my cheap matte medium stuff. Which we're finding out is quite yeah. the stuff. I, I mean, seriously. But I mean, I think this would be cool too. Because the problem with this stuff is, and this is really grabby. So it is kinesthetic. Kinesthetic. Tactile yeah. learning. Tactile learning, yes. And I think it would be a really interesting, if you visualize it, pocket. Ooh, yes. All right, well, that's on, on, that's on the agenda for, and look at this, how cool this is. This is the texture gesso. That's the, that's the Montmart. Yeah. I, Right. Clear texture. I yes, finally so. used up the last of that in the jar. I mean, I've got a whole new jar here. That brand this. new little bottle. Brand new little bottle. And I can tell you already that this is going to be a pain in the patootie, so I'm just going to rip that dude off of there. Um, if you don't have this stuff... Oh, Paula's left-handed. Oh, man. <laughs> but you don't do much calligraphy. Uh, <clears throat> anyway, this is Mod Podge. And this is after I, I think had Eddie's a left-handed. Added, Eddie? added. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Now I'm loving that. I, I like the shiny side. I I don't know that I do because I think it really takes away from the texture. Well, I'm being. And I'm just, you're just seeing the bling bling I'm, over there, and it's like I don't know. After a while, that would hurt my eyes. I like this because you can appreciate the textures. I told her it kind of looks like, you know, that I think it was a, a popular fabric, especially in the 80s for, like, you know, cocktail dresses. <laughs> That's what it kind of looks like. Makes um, you very quite, uncomfortable. Get out your martini glass. Yes. Okie dokie. Now I'll put that <clears throat> over here because that is for Tweaky Tuesday. There's a little I, teaser for Tweaky Tuesday. Yeah. We'll actually do it. Okay. <laughs> New stencils. I'm so excited about them. I know we said we weren't going to put anything in the shop, but <clears throat> Darcy I, came with, came to me with a little collab thing. And plus, this was a little bit before we were even, you know, yeah, deep into the I, website. Yeah, I voted transition. on it because it's something I, I really felt like it she went wanted. with my doors. And, you know, I was kind of in a bind because I wanted to more, and this is what I love about this. Here you have the big fat lines, the smaller lines, and then you've got these. There's my other little dude here. Oh. And this one in the smaller size. So we're going to go through all of them. But I have to share with you what happened first. Yeah. <clears throat> it's still on the plate over there, and we may have to bust out old. And since I've got, look at, do you <clears throat> notice my nice clean, clean paper? Paper? Okay. So there, there are two of them. Oh, so S well S W L. I think she's further back in the stream. I'm gonna tell her that. But she did say that she's left-handed and a calligrapher, and she learned with the right-handed. Bibs initially also received many compliments on regular handwriting despite being a lefty. Lefties unite! <laughs> hey, you are an exception. Yeah. Cause I well, tried I to teach calligraphy and all of my left-handed children in the classroom. Well, you know, some high school students are not terribly motivated. And if yeah. it just doesn't just, you know, happen. Now, I think if they'd really wanted to do it, had a deep desire to do it. They might have but overcome it, but they didn't. We, we just kind of gave up, and I didn't know what to do. Yeah. All right. Now, this, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to put a link to, this, to the stencils. 
Oh, are you finished talking to me? Yeah, I am. This is a flop off. Oh. I know. Okay. Now I'm going to tell you why this worked. Before, you know, I would say, well, that worked. Look, I've got a really good one there. I wonder, well, you have to just stop and think about it. <clears throat> All right. So the color you see here is Naples Open, and it's Naples Yellow Open, golden, of course. The open I have capitalized because that's very important. With permanent maroon, which wasn't open, regular. And it dries fairly fast, not horribly. I mixed violently on the plate. <laughs> Until they were well, very important information. Well integrated. You can tell. You don't see yellow here and you don't see maroon here. That means I really mixed well and did a lot of braying. Okay, I got two pulls and a flop off and a positive. <clears throat> I know. I'm, I'm, I don't know what the deal is. Stuff positive is blowing in. Positive this. So I'm getting four. Prints from one little, yeah, one run, one run. Because here's here's the first one. Okay, I did it over the top of this one. Still had some stuff on the plate, so I went ahead and I took this. This one already had my little stars that I yeah that didn't work out very well. You know sometimes. Things do and sometimes they don't. I painted these little stars on with this stuff. I don't know that it was that color. Oh no, here's the light blue. I keep hearing the, the diffusers on over there. And I keep hearing it, you know, kind of bubble or chirp or whatever. And I think that, you know, like Mazzy's over here licking. Like, oh. <laughs> okay, so this. this is, I think that this light blue is the color yeah. that was on here. And painted those on. And, you know, I don't, I, I think it looks kind of cool. I don't know that it would be something that everyone would like, but it, it's kind of, it looks kind of worn out and, and, and mussed up and whatnot. I liked it. Uh -huh. So then I pulled that with the Naples yellow, but this is, I put this down and picked up some more off of the other. So we have one, two, three prints. But also remember, when your stencil is new, it's going to pick up that stuff. But the other thing is, it remained wet enough for me to do that. So, those are all important factors there. Uh, SWL said that once she found, yes, her, her teacher was extremely rude. Um, <laughs> and found, I wasn't rude, I was just frustrated and gave up. Yeah. She said once she found the left-handed nibs, it was super easy. Uh, we didn't we did didn't not know. know about that until till much two or three years later because um, it was Adrian. Mm -hmm. Bless her heart, and she really did she did try hard, but she had other things that she wanted to do, so it, it wasn't you know everybody was. It didn't there. destroy her. It didn't destroy her. It's <laughs> good. Okay, so I have this print. And it'll be, this will be, it's like fourth printing. But I don't know that I want to use this one because of the border around it. Now this one is going to work perfectly. So let's do that oh. one. Okay. Oh, All right, so both. No, 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 we're not going to get into that. I'm sorry, back up. Let back me talk, up. can I talk about stencils just for a second? Yeah, you can, go ahead. Okay, so both of these stencils, because there's two, two patterns. One's called Peacock Swirls, and the other one is Birdie Whirls, because I thought they were a little bit Tim burton -y. And so I asked Darcy if that was okay. She's she's very nice and kind, and she doesn't give me much pushback on, like, mm, like that was a bad name. I, I like the name, but, you know, ultimately, it is her design. <laughs> oh, yeah, absolutely. All right, now, see, you can see here, you can see this. So, we're going to get three out of this one. This is a flop off that I put on the plate. Very nice. All right, now I have to tell you what colors I used here because this is really important too. Uh, isn't this a beautiful blue? 
I love naming things. <laughs> Anne's really good at naming things, too. And so is Lisa Mingus. They, they're my, my go-to people about, like, if I'm having some struggles. <clears throat> This was placing the stencil onto the plate after pulling the print. Okay, this was what was on the back side here of this stencil. Those are definitely in Darcy's colors. So, here we are. I put this down. And that's... And this... The, the mucky muck that you see was already on there and I didn't have another open one. And I thought, oh, well, that'll be okay. Sometimes I'm okay with that kind of stuff. Yeah. And sometimes not so much for it. a close pen. There it is. Okay. Now, here's the colors I use. This is important, too. We're back to... I love this stuff. This is a Thalo Cyan Blue Red Shade with... And remember, this stuff dries like in a New York minute. And my kids would always say, are minutes shorter in New York? I said, yes, they are, sweetheart. Things are moving and I'm sure they all went home and told their mother. <laughs> all right, where are you? Where are you, Violet? There we go. All right, so we've got Violet Oxide open with this really fast drying stuff. And again, I violently mix them, but look at that color that you get when you mix these together. Isn't that remarkable? Yeah, I wouldn't have guessed that, actually. But, we need to get something down on this so that we can pull this. You know, like... Hello, Christy! And I'm kind of thinking, you know, I'm trying to lean towards... Okay, no worries. ...the colors that I have in my... My, uh... Hi, Kim! ...folder, my <coughs> tag, tag book. So, I'm going to... I think I'm going to go with this kind of dirty oh yes coppery that it's not super super strong but I think it's gonna be enough and remember I've also got still got some gold here yes and Carrie Griffiths has his um, so coming up in March what month are we in <laughs> I've been doing like years worth of you know things lately um, are going to go very nicely with these stencils. And that will definitely be happening with the new launch. Maybe. It's gonna take about another week because we've gotta get the site over to our developers to do the final, you know, all the crazy setup things that really are. The grunt work. <laughs> I don't know that it's grunt work. It's just, it's more technical. And, and we leave it to the more technical people. Actually, we're doing the grunt work. <laughs> oh, really? Yes. <laughs> to save us money. <laughs> yes. Now, I, you know, this is really weird. Do you notice how it seems like it's puddling? Oh, uh, Paula has a flop-off question. Go ahead, Paula. Hello, Carol. <laughs> what is <it>? Oh, <laughs> that, that was the question. She wants to know what a flop-off is. Oh. Well, a flop-off is... And I'm going to use tissue paper just simply because I can have my expert gluer over there glue it down for me. Do you want me to tell them what the flop off is um, while you're doing your thing there? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, so what happens is um, usually what you'll do like when you're playing around with your stencils, um, if you do the we're, technique where you put down paint first. We're, we're going to try, we're going to try one. We will try a flop off. We'll do one, but I'm going to tell you about it first. Okay. Layer of paint, stencil, take the stencil off. What comes off with the stencil, you hurry up, flop that off. But what she was saying, why it's really key information about the open paint, meaning that it stays wet Longer. long enough that you can flop off very nicely, because a lot of times it's dry by the time you're pulling up the stencil yeah. or well on its way. So then you flop that off to a piece of paper. You can either brayer it on or, you know, just push it lightly or, you know, depending on the stencil, of course, but that's a flop off. Yeah. <clears throat> there you go. You heard it here. All right, we're going to use gold. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, um, you can carry. We are going to set redirects, but um, perhaps if you want to do that. And I can give you a full list, like, so that way you don't have to, like, pull them. It'll be a little bit easier. Because our old site... They don't keep the same naming convention, and this is what it is. But also one of the reasons we're moving away from that type of site builder. <laughs> I'm glad that you chose Now this one. is more opaque. The other one, I, I really, I, I just, I wanted it to look very delicate very um opening 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 you know kind of so i use the more transparent gold this is the more opaque gold and i'm hoping it's going to take that pinky more into the orange range one never knows about these things And I just use a paper towel when I'm doing this, and I've used very thick paint because I left it rather thick to pull that layer that's already on there. So sometimes you don't you don't need to do this because you don't have enough paint on there. But I don't know. It, see, it's not coming through on this, but some will. Some will. If they're a little more wet, a little, little juicier paint. A little juicier, or no, I don't know. <clears throat> it's just some of them just do it more so than others. All right, let's see what we're getting there. Ah, yes. Very pretty. See, it toned down the the pinky pinky business there to a more, and I I was hoping that, you know, you never know. Yeah. It just depends on what you remembered to do. All righty. We've got those down. So, let's do some more. I wonder if I could do that. I've never really done that before. What what have you not ever done before? Um well I've got my brand new 12 by 12. You can scoot closer to your brayer paper if you would like. If that's more comfortable for you. Uh, yeah, I know, and I've got a little bubble in the bubble, bubble in, in the business here. <laughs> bubble in the business. <laughs> Might have to do that. It happens. It happens. Oh no, here, I want to do this first. And then I think what we might do is go to the smaller plates. Because I can then use the smaller. <laughs> okay, now here is, you can see this is this was the initial brayering. This mm -hmm. was putting the, the blue down and then getting the, and then pulling off. And then that other one, of course, was the flop off. All right, let's see here. I'm going to try. I do have green, but let's let's use some of this. No, no, I don't think so. No, 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 no. All right, I'm thinking this. Yeah, and we're thinking about. Did you did you already say that with the the twelve by twelve that we're thinking about cutting? Yes. <clears throat> As I, you know, the whole thing about it is, when you're going with the 12 by 12, I just won't use it that often. I mean, I, I used the other one, and I did a whole... Well, you don't have 12 by 12 paper. I don't have 12 by 12 paper. So that's kind of... And it, it, you know, it's going to involve a whole whole new... Whereas the 9 by 12, I mean, I'm, I'm using that dude all the time. And that's why I told Mariah I needed another one is so that we can have, you know, a backup. <laughs> Need a backup. Now this is some of that paint that might be coming through. Unless you bray it all off. <laughs> well, I'm not I love this mix though. I think it's going to be a good one, and I think it's going to really go with my doors. Yes. Because that's the whole thing that we're trying to do here. Oh, <clears> gosh, <throat> and I'm getting a great paper over here. 
Yeah, and Susan says, yeah, that's a problem. Paper size is limited, and Judy P says, yes, 12 by 12 waste paint for her. And if I were, you know, if I were using it constantly to do, you know, but I just really, and one of the reasons that Mariah and I went with the, what was the cost difference? Uh, that I don't know. Because you didn't look up the. I didn't. But I do know that it is a wee bit more expensive. Usually, like, the Jelly Arts is a little bit more expensive. And we love our gel press plates. Um, not to say that, you know, if Jelly Arts wants to send us some stuff, we're cool with that. Yeah. We'll give you some. Give you some, <laughs> give some love. Give you some love. We do have the one, the nine by twelve. The other, the nine by twelve that we have is a jelly arts plate. It doesn't seem to be as thick, which I don't know if that's a huge make it or break it, it hasn't kind of situation. Been. But you know, the main thing that we love <laughs> is the smell and the little bit of price difference. <laughs> Not to you know, we, we like that as well. All right, I think that this is meeting all of my expectations here. Ah, see, and Darcy, she does a lot of 12 by 12 papers because, see, she's a journal maker. She has, like, scrapbook paper mm -hmm. sizes, which are 12 by 12, and so that works That's, perfectly that for her. I think Carrie's the same way. The, the scrapbook paper is exactly what I used to use when I, was, when I did the 12 by 12. Yeah. I just used the back side of, you know, crap paper. <laughs> All righty here. All right, so we've got this little booger ready to go here. So we want to talk about what color we're going to put down. Um, Paula just purchased, because you know she's she's in the Netherlands. Um, she just got the A4 plate, the gel press one. So that way it'll fit more of their A4 paper. Oh. All right. Now, what I'm doing here is I'm putting this down naked because I know what I, I know that I'm going to pick this up with this piece of paper and what I want is I don't I don't want all of it to I don't want all this to go away I want this space here to show up with right. this pattern with this this print that that's you're picking up the negative space yes and I'm going to use oh I just about grabbed that wrong one Prussian blue, and I am not going to use open. Why? Because I'd like to, you know, move along here. Yeah. And op open <clears throat> is open is for situations where if you're in the desert, if you're in the desert, or if you want to do multiple pulls and you have all the time in the world. Yeah, you aren't on camera, <laughs> and you're not on camera. And remember, because. I have this is going in between the things there. I'm using a little bit more paint than I normally would on this plate. And I can oh look at this green. Oh my gosh, this is just super warm. Ah, see, Lynn does the same thing. She has tons of 12 by 12 um, yucky scrapbook paper she's had for years and she uses um, she uses it for that. Now we really want to work that down in there because <laughs> Darcy says, uh, <clears throat> "Open if you have 50 plates." <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Okay, that just doesn't seem to want to work down into those little spaces there. Make sure. Now, thank you, CEO. I'm going to get this ready because even though. And welcome, CEO. Let me know what your name is. I think you maybe. I feel like you've been here before. I'm gonna write that down. Hey, Julie. <laughs> Anne says, um, in a new, "New confession game. How many plates do you own? You guys go first. You guys go first." <laughs> Alrighty, well, I think that's going to be all I wanted it to be. 
Hey, I like this mechanical pencil. Number one, it has cool weight to it. Oh, okay. One of my gripes about mechanical pencils, and I think maybe one of the reasons that, you, like, when you are using it, like, you add too much pressure because of the weight. Of, I, I'm big on the weight of pens and pencils. Like, it, it affects the way you draw or write. But I, I like this. Just well, I'm just tell happy as... Oh no. Ducks in a pond that you're happy. Yeah. Left it on the lawn. Aw, that's so nice. Carla was watching someone explain about open paint. She thought, P taught me that. <laughs> that's so sweet. Well, you know, <clears throat> every product has a time and a place. And it. And if you're frustrated with it, it probably is because you're not used. You haven't discovered its place. <laughs> Anne's never counted. Or time. <laughs> Hi, Anne Lar. Good morning. Would you like me to do that? <sighs> if you tear it, I'm going to be really angry because I want it to come off of there so I can do another. Tear All right. It. So look at this. Isn't this spectacular? I need a little love. <laughs> Give her some love, y'all. Oh, oh my God, she's not cutting house. This is there. Okay, we're gonna let that set a while. Actually, that's probably going to dry fairly quickly. All right, let's move along. Oh, can't do that. I need the bigger one. Do I have another bigger one? I do. Oh yes, I do. Are you talking about tearing the print or tearing the stencil? Or both. Yeah. <laughs> little of both. Little both. Huh? Little of both. Alright, where's my other little? Alright, so I want to talk to you about the big ones. Mm. And you might think that you don't need the big ones. <laughs> I'm here to tell you, you need the big ones. Here's why. Have a little talk about the big ones. <laughs> <laughs> and the people that tell you that size doesn't matter are size matters. Job printers. Okay. So I've got this one, and you can see when I put it down. Now this is lovely for my little smaller. Get this little dude. These guys. Perfect. See, I have a nice border around there if I put it down there straight. In. And I will use this one in just a moment. But I wanted to show you this. Because I think that people think, well, you know, I don't really need that big one. What am I, how am I ever going to use that? I used to be one of those people. <laughs> yeah, well, remember, she's always begging me for the smallest thing, and can you make that thing smaller? Okay, now we need to talk about this. What color are we going to put over this? I'm just going with the Prussian blue again, and I know that sounds really boring. I just keep doing that. Thank you, Mariah. There, there's a little bit of fluff left back on that, but... Oh. I think it'll be all right. Yeah, it probably will be. And okay. I rough that up too much. You didn't. Good job. We'll use that. Maybe not right now. Okay, I don't want to lose this stencil though because I am going to, I have other purposes for it. Okay, so we decided. Prussian, right? Oh my god, Anne has 21. She has what? <laughs> 21 plates. Well, she's got way more than I do. Oh, I know. <laughs> I was sure that you were the, you know. I was the queen? Yeah, the queen P. Okay, well, we're going to do a little oh goodness. bit of mixing here. And sometimes I wish this was open. Uh, she's, it's, Darcy says, how dare you, Pete? Prussian blue is never boring. Well, yeah, I know, but I think you should, like, expand your repertoire of dark colors, not just <laughs> use that all the time. That's not your only darkness. That's my, not my only. Okay, I'm going to mix a little bit of... The open. Uh, this is why I told Mariah. Yeah. <laughs> I said I need it. I need Prussian and open. And the reason is, is because now I'm mixing it with this, and I'll show you what violent mixing means when I say violent mixing okay. in the future. You're not. Should we duck? I huh? mean, should we? <laughs> no. For those of you that are shy, avert your eyes. <laughs> okay, you put it out there, and then you just, you just really get after it. I mean, you know, it's just like, now, you know, you could do this on another, and I have, and I would, if I had a pattern already on here, but since I don't, 
I, it doesn't matter. I can I can swirl. Oh, mix it on the plate. What she's saying is so like a lot of you you know that like when Carrie does his videos, a lot of times he has his little five by seven out there, and that's where he mixes his paint and you know does all that and then rolls it out onto the bigger plate. Well, you want to do that if you've already got something down on the plate. Yeah. I, I highly recommend that. And Fran will usually, like, she has a little glass thing, and she mixes hers with the palette knife. No, there's no right or wrong way. No right or wrong way. Okay, we're going to do this one a little bit differently. And I know that that's the side that my thing is on. No, Anne can throw, she, she could have classes, and she says she has extra bedrooms. Oh. I don't know. Careful, Anne. <laughs> People might start showing us <laughs> with their paint. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. goodness, Diane, they, they have um, 18 inches of snow. Where is this? Uh, Diane, we are loving the uh, we are loving the quilt. It, it, it is now you know part of the uh, our bed and everything because that's where she sleeps. I, I noticed that she had it. <laughs> yeah, she's like, I want my quilt in the mor in because in the mornings what she does is she comes out here and uh, out here she comes out into the the living room and sits and, and watches her movies for a bit. Now see, we've got an excellent print there, which mm -hmm. we will put over here. That still a little bit left on there, a little bit more than I want on here. And I need to be moving along because I want to pull this without uh, using another layer. Yeah. Now this is the peacock swirls. And then Darcy also used these patterns in her latest uh, digital kits. And Darcy, if you want to drop that link in, go ahead, my dear. All right. Wow, a lot to do, a lot of mussing about here. That's a lot. And I'm, I'm, I'm always happy when I see that coming up on the edge. What that tells me is that that paint was wet enough that it's going to make a nice print. And I could actually do a, you know, a, a rub off on this. I'm not going to because um, we are just not going to do that today. No, oh, there you go. <laughs> I think it looks absolutely oh, flip your brayer over. stunning. Flip your brayer over. Pardon? Flip your brayer over. <gasps> Thank you. Whoever said that. <laughs> uh, Marsha. I don't know how many of those things got that have lines in them. That looks cool. Now, one of the reasons that paint still stayed back onto the plate is because she was going paint to paint. That happens. Yes. Unless, of course, she wanted to leave it and let it dry on there. Then more of it would come up. But for a quick... And I didn't, you know, I didn't really care if it was sort of spotty because the, I wanted it to look kind of like what the underneath layer is. I just wanted some of that underneath layer part that emphasized the door. I, I want it to be there, but I don't want it to scream at you. Yeah. I, I'll, I'll make my bed and everything, Diane, <laughs> which doesn't happen often, um, and post that in Makers. But, uh, yes, so okay. Kate, Candy wants to know, so the stencil she just pulled would... Would it be used to do a flop off if she had the right paint on it? Correct. Yes. But see, that was a drier paint. Therefore, probably not really going to get a lot. And then you saw how the other one stuck earlier. Yeah. Because if it's going to, if it's right there in that very sticky stage, and especially on a brand new stencil, for whatever reason, it's just, it just seems a little extra sticky when it, when it doesn't have the paint quite built up on it. Um, so that's why it grabbed onto that paper like it did. Yeah. And, and that was, that was the, the, the paper had, uh, the paper was not primed with any other paint or anything. It yeah. It was just, yeah. That's why the open is really great because you, yes. you know it's, it's, it's plenty, you know, still wet enough 
to transfer off onto the paper and it's not going to be super sticky and stick to the paper. All right, let's look and see what we've got going here as far as the next project here. Okay, so I've got these really weird, remember when I did these? Mm -hmm. I'm thinking that that might be interesting. And then I've got this one, which is a tissue paper that Mariah glued down. And for those of you that are into like digital papers and, and fun stuff, oh, and you've got to look at it um, because, well, she posted them in Makers, but there's a kitty that she calls the Mariah Kitty because it has a little hat on it, even has a little sucker. It's so cute. A little scarf. It's the Mariah Kitty. Anyway. Okay. Do go check those out if you like printables. <clears throat> I don't know what I'm thinking. I'm thinking, and I may be sorry that I do that, that kind of weird red. Mm. Weird red? Weird red. Not the Venetian. Not you. You. No, not you. <laughs> no. Eh. No. Well, where are you? Yes, maybe that is you. Just looking for my other red. Gosh, this is baffling. Oh well, let's just use permanent maroon. Okay, it's not open. So we're not going to have a lot of time to be, um, you know, moving about the cabin and making decisions and you know yeah. that sort of thing and I'm going to go ahead and put this down and I might be able to get a I like the llama too what so in Darcy's new little digital set she has like all these little animals they are so cute and I mean of course the you know Mariah Kitty but then there's a llama there's a golden retriever um those were my two, like, other ones that I was like, oh my god, they're so cute. And which one would be P? Uh, that was what else I was thinking. Kind of the llama. But I was thinking more like the golden retriever. Oh, a husky. There's a husky. It's a little puppy, isn't it? Yeah, is it an alpaca or is it a llama? I think it might be an alpaca. I can't, we looked up the difference and I can't remember what the differences are. On well, I think it's more size. There, yeah. And then there's vicunas that are even, um, I think, smaller. What do you think? And it's a little bit about their head shape, too. A little bit. Head shape is a bit different. I love that. Yeah. That looks really cool. I think it looks really cool too. Now, if I don't like the yellow after this dries, I can come back and do something else with it. All right, let's get. Remember, we've got. Oh goodness! My tummy is I didn't eat anything for breakfast this morning. I, I, I didn't, didn't have time. I didn't have time either because I was so busy and excited about. All of this new stuff that I had because I haven't had any new stuff for a while. Oh my gosh, look at that. Now, I could probably pull this, but I'm going Ooh. to leave it because look at this wonderfulness there. The crazing of the paint mm -hmm. because of the new stencil. Oh, that's, yeah, being a bird. I've noticed that uh, I think the finches are on the move because we have different little birds that are starting to show up. There was a little brown one out there that was different than spring is nearing, although it's very cold. Ooh, otter. Otter's good. Oh, Dawn says she'd be a crow. Hello, Dawn.
Now this stencil really is a pretty good one. I don't think you've got to worry so much about it filling in. But um, I just thought I had this wonderful paint on here and it really is kind of a shame to just And I'll have it on the tissue paper. Oh, Eddie would be a flamingo. Uh, Paula said she'd be a, a funny drawn um, elephant. <laughs> yeah, I knew that blurbed out a little bit, but hey, not bad. I like it. And we could do some more of that, but we're not going to. Okay. Now, got that done. All right, moving right along. Next one. Yeah. That's not gonna be I hope Carrie'd be a dragon. Now, I don't know. Do I want the fat one? And do I want more showing? More showing. Uh. Well, see, then we've got choices here. We've got this one which will emphasize more of the lines. Yeah, and I think it fits the colors because it's very peacocky. Okay. All right, I, well, if I can find a plate, an open plate. Yeah. Okay, get that up there. Trash. <laughs> That's right, that's what P always says, that she'd be a crow, because she likes to pick up little things. Sparkly things. Mm -hmm. I'm bringing them back to the nest. Yes. Okay, we're going to do this exactly the same way that we just did the other one. Lay it down so that we've got, and you can pick it up, and you can check on the other side to see, you know, around your edges there that you, you're within the per. And I did that plate. purposefully, so, you know, when <clears throat> when the designers send me things, it's usually, it's like, they just send me the design, and then Brad and I size it to what kind of our standards have become, and certainly will be for sure in the new website. That's one of the exciting things, is that you guys are going to see a lot of old um, designs available in sizes maybe that never were, and we've revamped some, so... Very exciting stuff coming up. I'm oh, really yes, and combinations of different. Yeah. I'm not gonna... I know. It's, I know. I'm getting Shh. excited. Oh, but what I, I was try very try to do is think about all right. How would this particular design be used on the plate? Like how P is using it, and would it benefit from a little bit of you know margin inside of the plate, or would it be fine if it goes over, even though we call it a five by seven or eight by ten or nine by twelve? Now, with the 9 by 12 that's where we kind of just go, we're going to fit it into the 9 by 12 Like, if you want something big, we're going to give you the biggest thing that we possibly can, typically. Now, some of them, like this one, I did keep it a little bit more in because I think that it, it's, it's, it's kind of a show pc type thing. And if you wanted to move it around, you could. You might even be able to do a little flippy floppy with this thing. Might be kind of cool. Oops. I don't know. Well, I, I'm, I'm thinking about it, and I'm thinking about doing it on this um, Oh, definitely, Julie. I, I think that that can mess with you. Sleeping, for sure. I know, we're all very excited. <laughs> like, I think one more week. Could be, you know, a week and a half, but we're really pushing for one more week. We just kept saying, all right, well, you know, we're here, we're doing this thing, so why don't we... It's kind of like when you renovate something. <laughs> like, you go in to put in a new toilet, end up where you're doing the whole bathroom. <laughs> this is sort of how that yes. explains it. Yeah. So well. All right, I've got to yeah. make sure that... I don't know how much we're going to get because this was not an open. Yes, oh, definitely. Very fantastic question, and, and I can't believe Pete didn't mention it. But, yes, you can use retarder if you don't have open paint to create. Yes, 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 yes. mix it in. Now, one of the things you want to keep in mind with that retarder is that you want to mix it into your paint prior to 
putting it on the plate or if you do do like the little daub then put your retarder on top of it because what happens is you'll get like kind of a weird little you know a, a little blob because yeah. if it hasn't mixed in thoroughly it does some weird things and you'll you'll have like a little blob on your plate wherever you put the all retarder. right I, i'm not i can't pull it right right now. We're, we're getting a lot and this is why i i love my little plates all right we're gonna hey, ginger do some <laughs> and I don't even really care that this is like totally lined up. I knew a lot of people would get the renovation like feeling of, of it because or, or just any DIY project. It's like, you know, you go in to, to do something and then you look, okay, well back behind the baseboards there was this or, oh. Yeah, the floor's falling in. The floor falling in and bathrooms are notorious for, you know, those or, sorts you of know, surprises. I, I, I backed up into the wall and knocked a huge hole in the drywall as I was tiling. <laughs> So now we gotta redo that wall. Now we're just gonna repaint everything. Oh God, that, that's when you gotta be careful about painting a room because the paints won't match. So it's either like you have to stop at a certain <laughs> spot. It's kind of like that. Mm -hmm. Or we're organizing the shelf in your craft room. Mm -hmm. All right, now there's some of these little jobbers here. Can you see them? You need to be, I, I think I already messed that one up. Hey, it was a, a decision to leave some of them floppy because it's... Okay, I, well, not, they're going to flop about when you're doing what I'm doing. Yes. Otherwise, they're probably not going to even be a, an issue. An issue. You've got to dab carefully. Now, I look at that. I think that's starting to have some definite... It almost looks like little roses like that. Like, you know, like a, uh -huh. a bunch of like the little tiny roses all together. Okay, now see, these are, this is the big one. But then you come back in with this other thing and you can add. And, I mean, we could even go over it with this again. Let's do that. Oh, April, you don't really have to do much. I mean, it's really like, you know, you roll it off and then you want to get it off there because you don't want it drawing onto the tissue paper. And the problem is, is I've got nine by tens or eight by tens. <laughs> wind up. That's funny. And I don't, I, well, we'll just have to go with what we've got here because this is what I have. Okay. Do your thing. Do my thing. I love hanging these little jobbers on the, but that one doesn't really, oh yeah, it does down here on this end. Little things to hang it up, up there because number one, it's drying. It's always good to have a dry. Okay, what else do I have over here that I can print over? This. This is nice. But now I, you know, I need to get it back. It's it's kind of way too pinky like the other ones were. So we're just gonna have to. We're gonna do some quick pours. Oh yeah, you can mix a retarder with like if you have regular. Um, golden paints that aren't open, definitely. You, the, okay. the retarder can be mixed in with anything. Yeah, this is still drying. Any paint. Well, let's see if we can pull something here. Did this the very first, right? Yes. And remember, gold dries fast. Well, maybe at the end, I'll, I'll talk a little bit more about the website and, like, what our kind of plans are at this moment in time as far as, like, you know, shutdown and things like that, because Brad was saying. I don't know if you guys are that interested at this moment in time, I mean, or once we get a little bit closer to saying, all right, you know, this is the day, and then this is what's going to happen. And then Brad will tell me if I have it right. <laughs> I'm loving this. I'm getting such... Good, mm -hmm. um, the cool cracks. Mm -hmm. Oh, I like parquet wood. I think it looks cool. But I know it does have, sometimes, if it doesn't fit, then it's... All right, look at that. Isn't wonderful. that a beauty? And we've got wonderfulness here also. Okay, I'm, I'm thinking I can really, I can really use that. 
Okay, let's put these aside for a minute and allow our others to um, Okay, so I've got this paper. Yeah. I do too, Anne. Okay, who did this come from? Marsha? Why, or... why do you do that to me? <laughs> we got this in Happy Mail. I'm very appreciative that we did. Yeah, and I don't know why I've got this piece because I've got another one that's much wider. But I guess this will work. Oh, it'll be, there'll be a little line there. Oh, well, I think I'll make this work. And I want it to, the reason I'm looking at this is because I want to make sure that I've got it with the right side down. I just, I want to pick up some stuff here on this paper. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Joni want... said she sent that tissue. Thank you, Joni. Thank you, Joni. Yes. I am loving it. We're going to go with some transparent red iron oxide open so that we can use positive negative on, on the tissue paper. Love this tissue paper. I don't really often like writing, but if I can't read it... She's good with it. I'm good with it. Because she gets distracted. <laughs> she wants to read it. She wants to read it. Hey, as I'm talking to the person who sat in the oh, I'll antique store... Oh, I'll for, read some stuff. You know, an hour and a half while we looked at the entire, I mean, it had two stories of antiques. She sat there and read postcards written to people by other, you know, people, but you didn't know who, great. They, who they were. We still want to sort of read the words, right. but like not, we, we want them interrupted even more than they already are. Oh, we need to plant, we need to get our wildflowers going. You think they're going to reseed? Oh, they all, yeah, they're already coming back. Are they? Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Should I get more seeds just to, you know? Oh, I don't it, think it would hurt. Bulk it up. Should have done that probably about two weeks. Well, I don't know, because it's been pretty cold. I don't want all the little birds eating everything, because they will. Cool that looks. Yes. Oop. Oh, did I hit the? Yeah, you bumped. That's okay. I'll come in with a little of this one. The first layer on it. <laughs> so Susan said they used to have a, an exotic bird shop, and they used to use old newspapers at the bottom of the cages. It took her husband five times as long to clean the cages because he'd read the old newspapers. Great. Well, that flopped down there, not where I wanted it, but I, I'm just going to yeah, go with it. Go with it. <laughs> and the reason that we're still getting stuff off of here is because this was an open, open paint. Okay, well that's got some interesting stuff on it. Okay, let's do this job. I don't know. <laughs> See what this looks like. Maybe he was reading the new ones that, was, that he was uh, putting down. I don't really want to do that. I really want to get this. I think this is <laughs> awesome stuff. That's funny, Carla. What? 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 Hello, orange is one of my favorite French words that you, I think, it's one of your little made ups when you say the orange. <laughs> Brad and I chuckle about that too. 
Hey, Fran. We were wondering where you were at. Now, see what I mean by this? Look at this. That's cool. Isn't that wonderful? All right. We can let this dry, but we're not going to because we, we've got we got things to do and people to see here. So we're going to go on. And I'm just going to ignore the fact that, you know, this is... Mm -hmm. Because I've got some other things that I need to um, address here. Okay. I've got this. And I want this to work with my... That's old school. It, it is. I, I, I found it. <laughs> so what I, I'm going to do here, I want it to be a light color. And I want it to be sort of... Oh, I don't necessarily... I don't want it to be like super opaque, but I want it to be a little bit yeah. opaque. But I also need it to be kind of light. I don't know. I know. It's just decisions, 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 decisions. What about the, like, and are you thinking that this is going to go with your journal, perhaps? Or are you just yeah. kind of doing whatever at this point? Yeah, because remember, I, ha I have Naples Yellow. Yeah. Is one of my. I think that's a good call. Colors. Now, this is not open. Hi, Sharon. Thanks I'm, for having me. I'm thinking it. that's okay, because remember, we've got, mm -hmm. this is open here, and it's still wet. So it's it's gonna this is gonna go wet because I'm going to go right over the top of it. Well, some of it is. Mm. Oh, it's getting kind of a weird, kind of blotchy weird. That's okay. No. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Very not, interesting what's that's happening. I'm just picking up. Yeah, I'm you're not having a pain out here. Oh, well, here, we'll just put a little open on here and get this show on the road. Hello, Sharon. Thank you oh, for joining that, us. That should... That should, you know, loosen things up here. But look at you notice there's different. the different, the the open is a slightly different yellow than the. Yeah, it's a little brighter. Little bit brighter. Peacocks and daisies. I think that should be a good combo. Yeah. <laughs> I think she's going to fix her studio. <laughs> what? Uh, well, Fran has finished her box because her and Sharon are having kind of a, a challenge. Um, I think Fran challenged her, Sharon. I don't know if it's a box off. Oh, the box off. Yeah, I saw her box. I liked it. <laughs> yeah. She's been working on hinges or uh, corners. That's what she said. Corners. Oh, that's fabulous. Look at that. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. All right. What Flip else? the brayer. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Okay, I'm not going to do that on that one. Um, because I want to really, 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 really get a lot of that underneath. Because... Now, we're probably not going to get that much. And it's not going to show off that much. But if I hand this to Mariah at this stage, and there's a lot of open paper there, it will make some very interesting things happen with these sprays. Yes. But it has to dry. But it needs to dry. That's 
cool looking. <laughs> That's cool looking. And this is cool looking, and I'm not thinking I was going to use that, but I'm really liking this just like it is. How are you going to pull it? Well, remember, it is open. Mmm. And I've got, and this is still wet. I could get some transfer off of that. Uh huh. But look at this. Ooh. Very cool. It is going to be very, very cool. All right, let's, um, what do we have here? Let's Bye, Paula. Be safe. Do a little rubby dub dub. You just kind of have to be aware when you're out here and you're 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 going with your the little floppy doos like that one. This is probably not the best stencil in the world to be doing this with. But if you are somewhat aware of that, you can get somewhat of a layer of you know stuff going on here. Great idea, Candy. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. What? She says, um, so Heather's trying to figure out, you know, drawing stencils, and it, it is, it's a tricky process. Um, I mean, we have a couple of our designers here, they'll tell you that, you know, we all have our struggles. I Actually, when I was doing Darcy's thing, because I had to reverse it out, the first one I cut, I was like, oh, yeah, I totally forgot to do that. Um, <laughs> so it came Oops. out in like a, a mask, which is not what we wanted. We moved the border thing around it. It's just my brain goes that way. But if you trace the stencils that you might have, that would help you kind of maybe start to, through that, like, kinetic learning. Um, or kinesthetic. There we go. Kinesthetic, kinesthetic. I believe, is how they, that was said. Thank you, Jacqueline, for that. Um, I love learning those new words. I knew there was a word for it. But yes, I think that would be. Muscle memory is another way to say yeah. it. If you can't remember the K word. <laughs> yes, you can't remember the K word. I think this is going to be beautiful. Hey, Sandra. I, I'm, I'm thinking about putting that sort of pale blue over this. Yes. I don't know. I might go ahead and do a batik <clears throat> crinkle. Yes. People were asking about the crackle. And I told them, I said, you know, we've done the crackle in a, a few... In fact, we dedicated one stream to the crackle. Yeah. But it certainly does not um, mean we can't. Hey, Maya. I'm just trying to keep my paper. And this is what I love about this. But butcher. we have 13 minutes. What's your paper? All right. Well, let's 12 go. 12 minutes. Uh, let's go through and let me see if some of these are. I don't know. This might be fine enough to pull. It was one of the first ones that we did. Remember, this was the this was the um, flop off onto the plate, and I know that because I left my note here. <laughs> what I love about the tissue is it just keeps giving you another layer of wonderful crackiness. Now that's a little bit more of a crack than I really would have wanted. Oh yes, we are shipping now. Uh, yeah, I mean, we're, we're still, we, if you guys want to order. Operational. Yes, if you guys want to order anything, and obviously we did add, um, I know this was a little bit of a special kind of twist, but you know, Darcy was like, hey, I'm launching this paper. And then I was like, well, I think that the stencil needs to go along with it. Let's not wait. And so that's why it was kind of a little special case because she had her, her papers going out with it. And I thought that, that it needed to all go out together. So it is listed on the, the old, the, you know, current website. And then um, we'll also, everything obviously will be transferred. Not everything, actually. There are some discontinuations um, or some products, um, some of the designs have been altered and are a little bit different. 
So, oh, thank you, Katrina. Thank you. Welcome to the channel. So, but yeah, I mean, we're still business as usual. If you guys see something in the shop, you know, if, if there's something that you've been waiting for, please place your order. Do that. Um, all, all is good. And what will happen, um, I guess since we're kind of transitioning into this conversation anyway, is that um, we will hopefully do it late at night. Um, so there won't be much of a downtime, but there may be one or two days where nothing will, you know, happen. So we will get out whatever orders have been placed on the current website and then let you guys know when the new one is back up and running. The other thing that I kind of wanted to give you guys a heads up on, um, if your subscription to the Artie Perks is coming up on, um, on YouTube, one of the things to maybe think about is that, um, now we'll let you guys know, because I think we want to have the new website up first, and then we'll say, all right, you may want to look at your, your when it re-ups, because we're going to start transferring anybody that, especially like the Loverly and the Mucky Muck. Those two levels are going to be done through the website. And we'll give you guys plenty of like notice and help you walk you through it and you know just let us know but i want to kind of give you a heads up of how that that's going to work because once we have everybody transitioned over that wants to transition over we will remove the two levels from youtube you can still be a, an already purchased wow pousy wowsy member if that's like if you want to just do the basic support thing which is so cool and we very much appreciate that and you want to play with the emojis and things like that inside of chat that will still be there in that very basic palsy wowsy level but if you want to move over into getting the stencil dis discounts and all the other things i mean we have other plans of you know and, and we're always adding new product you guys are going to be blown away i think I, I know pete was pretty excited about some of the revamps the new things that we've done I all was. of the new sizes and then i cannot tell you the I mean, even if our designers stopped designing today, we would have plenty of things <laughs> to, to get through. I mean, from all of our designers, there, there's a, a, a plethora you of have designs. Files. Yes, that I cannot wait for us to get through. Plus, you know, Brad has some ideas about some things. And, you know, hopefully P will, you know, here and there, she, she comes up with some things. We need to, like, look at the stamps. There will be new stamps. All of that stuff will definitely be going on over there in the new website. Um, so if there are any questions, do let me know. If um, you don't want to ask them here. Oh, and thank you, Katrina. Welcome to Palsy Wowsy. That's awesome. Um, if you have any questions, do let us know, um, or, or just message me if you, you have, if you want to ask something behind the scenes, that, that's totally cool too. Hello, Allison. Welcome. All right. Here are my doors and I want you to see how I think that Ooh. these are going to play out together. Celestial peacocks. And even yes, you can still order. Because I've got the stars and this. Yeah, do not wait. If you want to place an order, please place this, an order. But I really am wanting to. Ooh, yes, that one's beautiful, but I don't know that it kind of goes with this one. Or it could be like the back side of a panel or could be tags. That's this is true. Yeah. This could be the back of this door. Mm-hmm. But I think if I go over this with oh, the um, careful now. one of these, oh, you know, maybe the little one, mm -hmm. the smaller one with the more wispy, and do it in, in like a dark gold, yeah, really dark gold. Oh, Anthony had to go out and shovel snow. That's no fun. Oh, man. It's been chilly here. It's been rainy. Yeah, we, we, uh, that is one of the things that really. I mean, we do have horrible ice storms here, but it usually is and like this you know, three one, or four days I just, and then you're done. You know, it might need one more layer of something. Oh, thanks, Paula. But I do. I, I love that, and I, and you have to remember. Remember my. Um, let me get back because this is one of the things that I really wanted to happen with the binding. 
all of a sudden we've got this opened up. We can bring in, we can bring in the oranges. We can bring in the uh, rusty colors. The Carla, it'll be okay. She says I can't handle this Tuesday morning closing in the same way. I know. <laughs> it'll be okay. We're we're here. We're here. We still will be here. Well, if the downtime, it, like I said, it could be like, you know, one or two days. But I I, I don't It may it. not even be that. Right. But we just like to, you know, this is like with our clients. We, we kind of go, you know, this, when you're changing over from, you know, one hosting to another, things get interesting. And even though we've done it and we could have done it the exact same way, it, it just doesn't always play out that way. So we're just kind of prepping you guys, letting you know that, hey, if it's down for a day or two, it's not unexpected. It's obviously not ideal, but not unexpected. Yeah. Oh, and then as Ann says, if you guys, please do hit those thumbsy upsies. Those of you that have kind of come in at the later part, we yes. do very much appreciate it. It lets people know that you liked it and some other people that like the, you know, things that you like may like it as, as well. Tambien. I love this. I love where it's going. Maybe we... Now, I will just tell you right now, I, I, I want you all to look at this because, you know, I've got some more doors that will be added. So that is the other uh -huh. thing. You know, I, I know Hi, I've, I've got these now that I can put on my other doors. And the other doors, I've, I've got this idea. Uh -huh. But if you have some ideas on what you think how I might add my extra, or my extra doors... <clears throat> Yeah, a lot of the Tuesday mornings are closing. But, you know, it's crazy. We got a... I, I told Brad one day, I was like, oh, man, the Tuesday morning around here, another one was closing. And then a couple hours later, they sent an email saying, oops, sorry, that's not one of the stores, so I guess it's staying open. But I'm like, oh, man, I'm is sure that somebody one, got in trouble. Is for that the one over there? Um... That one That one closed a long time ago. I think what they were talking about is the one over in Garland there, the um... other one that we kind of go to. Um, but it isn't closing. Okay. Well, there's not really anything that we need. No. Um, we should stay home and work on what we've got. Yes. But I just, I'm, I'm so <laughs> jazzed about the new, the, the new stencils and the new prints. And I just think, look at how gorgeous that is. Put those opposite each other. Put that on a little door. I don't know, maybe a tag. Yeah. Yeah. Very fun stuff. Yeah, they really haven't gotten the same stuff that, you know, like pre-COVID, um, they were fantastic. All, it used to get all kinds of awesome things. But then it seemed like, you know, after that, it, it just, they didn't have the and same our stuff. wonderful little store that oh, we used loved to it. And the guy that worked there was he awesome. He was so nice. Yeah, he kind of knew us. <laughs> I was worried about that. <laughs> but, you know, yeah, it's also they... nice. <laughs> Hello, Mrs. Carmichael. So glad to see you back again. <laughs> You don't know my name. No. <laughs> okay, guys. Well, super duper fun stream. We will be back on Tuesday to tweak some things, probably make some tags. Are you guys sick of making tags? I'm not. I love making them. I think it's fun. I um, I, I really like it because I look at each one of them as a, a little, um, you know, it's a, it's a yeah, it's a piece of artwork. I, that's how I look at them. I'd have to sew that on to that other one or something. Yeah. Sure okay, that. guys. Well, we will see you back there on Tuesday. We'll, we'll figure out exactly what we're doing then. But thanks so much for hanging out with us. And if you haven't given that thumbsy upsy and you did enjoy what you saw here today, that'd be much appreciated. Also, please come back. Leave a comment. We'd love to hear those. Love them. Love them. Um, and then, uh, yeah, we'll see you over Makers as well. Bye, guys. Adios.